Good evening, everyone. Hope you're doing well. Welcome. We're going to get started here in just a second. Welcome to Persona 5, Part 1. Just want to make sure everything's good to go. Gonna accept the Thieves Guild here. Just let me know if, like, sound is not balanced. This is my first time trying the PS4 out with this, so. We'll let the opening run, and you can kind of give me some feedback on that. And, uh, we'll go from there. Thanks for being here. Plus, you gotta love the opening to this game. It's so good. <laughs> How are you today, Potato and Grand Taco? I was talking about losing the end a little bit. What's the release date for that potato? I hadn't been watching too closely, but I'll probably pick that one up. Is there any English release date that we know of? Oh, that sucks. Alright, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to go here to my complete save data, and I'd actually started a new game plus a while ago, but you can see I'm level 4 there, so we'll go from there. Poor Australia man has got, got the uh, good old bad stuff. That internet not working well. Oh, look at this. Here's all the DLC that you downloaded. Oh, that'll do it. Yeah, someone here at my clear data. Social stats. Persona compendium, skill cards, equipment, money, and playtime. Furthermore, you will also inherit any special items you receive from your confidant relationships. Which I believe was like six people or so that I got to rank ten, if I remember right. Confidant's Christmas present, your confidant relationship will grow more quickly when you have a persona of the same arcana as them. If you want to go on lots of outings with your confidant without raising the rank, don't bring a persona that matches their arcana. Thanks to your confidant's farewell presence, some of their confidant abilities will unlock immediately after they become your confidant once again. Hey, that's always that good thing. This is this gonna make it story is fun. a work of fiction. Um I have no idea what the bonus boss is. Like, I have a guess as to where it takes place, but that, that's a spoiler I've been trying to avoid. Plus, one thing I did not do in my main playthrough is uh, fight... Um, what's his name in, uh, in the Similarities subway? Between characters or events she said Idol, he'll show up. Or dead in your world. The trope that's common with Persona 5, I can't remember. Only those who have agreed to the above have the privilege... Of partaking in this game. Another fun fact: this right here, this agreement, the first time I did it, if I hit "I do not agree," it just kicks you back to the start. <laughs> it 
It's like, well, you don't agree, so I uh, get out of here. The contract has been sealed. The world is not as it should be. It's filled with distortion, and ruin can no longer be avoided. Those who oppose fate and desire change. From time to time, they were referred to as tricksters. The way he talks, it makes me think instead of tricksters, he's just like, Darn kids, get off my lawn. He's just, he's just old school, man, you know. You are the trickster. Now is the time to rise against the abyss of distortion. But again, thank you for showing up. It's really nice to have that support already from you guys. Hey look, it's Harley's work. <laughs> Kinda does, but you know, honestly. In comes Lugia. They do a really good job with these cutscenes, and I get that there's an animation, or a, uh, an anime rather, but I haven't had a chance to watch it yet. Stay calm, you can get away now. We'll retrieve the briefcase on our end. Hmm? Who's that? Don't worry about us. Just concentrate on getting away. Poor Morgana, just boyish voice, always. Cool, Joker. Comparing power levels. Take this. Joker. This time it doesn't make it a tutorial. <laughs> Good. You defeated them with ease. More of them? Be careful. Joker behind you. Go through that door. All right. Come on, man. Don't worry, I'm picking up everyone's voices. Just go, Joker.
What? Up ahead, stop. This is bad. Hi, Joker. You'll never get away if you just keep fighting. Hide in the shadows and sneak past when you see an opening. Hey, are you sure he came in this way? Understood. I will continue the search. All right. Now's your chance. Run for the stairs. Some of the few lines he plays, or speaks. I really like the theme of this one being the thieves and stuff. It's really cool. Like, I'm enjoying Persona 4 Golden, but this is just so fucking stylish. It's awesome. <laughs> Suspect secure. Didn't expect to find some kid. You have your teammate to thank for this. You were sold out. Suspect confirmed. Cuff it. That was how Nian was sent to prison. Guess the drug was too strong. Wake him up. This is brutal. No dozing off. Yeah, Nian, what the heck, man? You still don't get it, do you? Give it up! Come on, cooperate. What? You want another shot? Huh? What about the camera? Are you thinking it can be used as video evidence? So you're not that dumb. Which is good. Because we get to take as much time as we need. Oh, come on, man. Obstruction of justice, blackmail, defamation, possession of weapons. Manslaughter, too, yeah? Talk about the works. It's a thing that all those crimes were led by a punk like this. And you seem to be enjoying every second of it. Huh? I'll take uh, name suggestions to you. Everything's hazy. I can't remember. Ooh. Um, I don't know. I feel like I'm kind of a casual when it comes to this game. Uh, I played normal the first time through. I could probably be okay with hard, but I just, since I've already played it, I'm not really interested in taking forever, so I'm going to just stick with normal, I think, just because. You should know your place.
Yeah, Potato, you should know your place. Sign here. It's a confession under your name. Really, Potato? Really? <laughs> Don't expect to walk out of here in one piece. We are going to make you understand. One must take full responsibility for their actions. I don't remember how many characters I have, let me see. Yeah, it would, it would fit. Any other suggestions besides Potato Coon? <laughs> Since that's the only suggestion I received. We'll have to live with this, guys, if this happens. I'm just letting you know. And it will be single-handedly your fault. See, he just wants it so that all of the waifus will call him Potato Coon in this game. That's what it's really about. Guaranteed. Alright, there we go. Last chance. Dun 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 Oh no, too late, Liz. No. Me, this area is off. I'm I gotta restart the now. Public prosecutor's office. The prosecutor's office? What business do you have here? Just let me through. It's urgent. There's something I need to confirm with the suspect. Nijima-san, I believe this case is no longer in your jurisdiction. Besides... You prosecutor sign Nijima? There's a call from your director. Hurry and get it over with. To be frank, you're being an inconvenience. How rude. Hmm. I thought I ordered you to stand by. Red October, standing by. I'm responsible for this case, yet I'm not even being allowed an interrogation? I'm calling because I knew you'd bring it up. I will not be convinced unless I confirm it for myself. This is my case. Uh, good luck to you then. I won't be expecting much, though. Uh, Prosecutor, I forgot to mention something important. Your time will be cut short. We can't permit you to talk with him for long. <sighs> it's for your own sake. His methods are unknown. After all, we don't even know if it's safe to simply meet and speak with him. I understand. I like how they say that she'll, her time will get cut short yet, like, all these cutscenes that wind up happening just are there for eternity. I didn't expect like it to be you. Hours. You'll be answering my questions this time. <sighs> Those bastards. Can you hear me? It seems you've been through a lot. Almost anything can happen here. And I can't stop them. That's why I need you to answer me honestly. I don't have much time either. What was your objective? Why did you cause such a major incident? I didn't think it was a prank from the get-go, but I couldn't assemble a case for prosecution. It's because I couldn't figure out the method behind it. I'll give you guys some uh, choice in this. So which dialogue would you like, top or bottom? I kind of wish in a way you could do it like the Telltale here, where you could have uh, audience votes or something like that to take care of it. <coughs> Little audience participation. Well, I know that you would say either one. I am leaning towards the top one, because I think last time I did the bottom one. So I'm going to go with that one. Of course you could. 
Be a little bit smartassy. There's no way I could be convinced of such a world just by reading the reports. It seems you're coherent. When and where did you find out about that world? How is it even possible to steal another's heart? Now, tell me your account of everything. Start from the very beginning. Shot through the heart, and you're to blame. Is that how? Is that how you steal hearts? The way she talks makes me think like the game that started a half year ago sounds like uh, like most dangerous game or something. <laughs> that short story. Only you can end it. Don't mind all these save files for various overrates. Turn off XP. Just leave it level one potato free for it. How odd! What is this? Why is it suddenly on my phone? I get the feeling that's what's going on. Hey, Husky, how are you? Hunchback guys coming off the drain, man, I tell ya. So let's take it to the back streets. You never know if you don't go wherever right go. Go for the moon.
Starting today, Sojiro Sakura will be taking care of me. Or is it Sakura? Yeah, I guess it's Sakura. His house should be in the back streets of this residential area. All sorts of people live in the city. Try listening to their conversations or press the X button to talk to them. You might learn something new. Low officer. Unfriendly officer. Yes. I want to ask for directions. Hmm, you want to get to that residence at the address. It's in an alley a bit further back. Take a right after that apartment with the stairs. Considering he's supposed to be unfriendly, he sure was quite helpful. So... <laughs> I don't know what the deal is with that. At any rate. Here it is. I can see inside the store through the glass. There aren't too many customers. Oh, I have to go to this restaurant. My bad. Have you finished uh, an initial playthrough yet, Husky? I know you would gotten your Switch like a month ago or so. So I don't know how much you would played. The nameplate here says Sakura. It looks like this uh, might be Sojiro Sakura's house. Even after ringing the doorbell, it doesn't look like anyone will answer the door. Maybe he's gone out. Looks like no one's home. Oh yeah, Sakura's son's usually at his cafe around this time. Well, the blonde in the back alley, so I should make my other deliveries first. Next, I need to take this package to Mumble Mumble. Mm -hmm. Looks like this place is a little long. I'll go inside. Something similar happened just the other day. Hmm. Vertical is the name of a shellfish used for farming pearls. Oh, right. They did say that was today. Oh, we'll be going now. The payment's on the table. Thanks for coming. Uh, this place is in the back alley, so there's no worries of a car crashing in here. What now? There's been a string of those rampage accidents, you know. I just hope that none happen around here. None of my concern. <laughs> well, see you next time. Snowed in, you say, Husky. Like, two inches? <laughs> oh, four hours for just a single cup of joe. So, you're the guy. So you're Potato. <laughs> Is Sakura on here? Please take care of me. <laughs> uh -huh. I'm gonna have to pretend like I'm Potato because he made me do this. He made me name the character Potato Kun. I'm Sojiro Sakura. You'll be in my custody over the next year. I was wondering what kind of unruly kid would show up. But you're the one, huh? <laughs> Some lanky, tall, unruly kid with glasses that looks like a nerd. Have you been told? A customer of mine and your parents know each other, and... Well, not that that matters. Follow me. Shut up, California. I mean, potato. <laughs> this is your room. I'll at least give you sheets for your bed. Hmm? You look like you want to say something. Cluttered. It's on you to clean up the rest. I'll be leaving after I lock up each day. You'll be alone at night, but don't do anything stupid. I'll throw you out if you cause any trouble. Hey man, I'm just now, here. I got the gist of your situation. You protected some woman from a man forcing himself on her. He got injured, then sued you, right? 
That's what you get for sticking your nose in a matter between two adults. You did injure him, yeah? And now that you've got a criminal record, you were expelled from your high school. He fell over, man. The courts ordered you to transfer. He should have tied his shoelaces. Which your parents also approved. In other words, they got rid of you for being a pain in the ass. What shitty parents? Oh, this happened. Get, get out. It's best you not talk about anything unnecessary. I am in the restaurant business, you know. Behave yourself for the year. If nothing happens, your probation will be lifted. A whole year. Cause any problems, and you'll be sent straight to Juby. We'll be going to Shujin tomorrow. Going where? Shujin Academy. The school you'll be attending. We'll introduce ourselves properly to the staff there. There's rarely a place to accept someone like you, you know? What a waste of my Sunday. Your luggage arrived earlier. I left them over there. Your luggage. I'll be living here starting today. I should check out what's in here. It's a cardboard box sent from back home. It's full of clothes and daily necessities. I'll change into more comfortable clothes for now. It's a table covered in dust. If I draw a line in the dust with my finger, it'll probably be really easy to see. Wait, why did it? I didn't mean to go downstairs. Mm -hmm. You need something? Oh, I don't know if I had done this before. Interesting. Oh. Is that so? You should try cleaning it up if you don't like it. Sorry, I don't have the time to spare for you right now. Just head upstairs and clean. Keep to yourself. I know, right, Potato? Yeah, that's true, Husky. I know that's a big problem for that, but... Also have very weird um, exits off of your highways. Product of Colombia was what that sack that he just stood on stood for, or it said. I guess it's probably the coffee beans. <laughs> One of the uh, this. Uh, what are they called? Burlap sacks. Seriously. What the heck? I heard you making all sorts of noise up here, but I didn't think you were cleaning. Uh, Actually, huh. the place doesn't look too bad. Though it's only natural you'd want to keep your room tidy. Why don't you go to bed for tonight? You don't have anything better to be doing, right? I'm gonna close up shop and get out of here myself. I'm gonna head back then. I won't be the one looking after you if you get sick from staying up too late. You got that? You got that potato? Huh? Do you? Sleeping in your bed will move you forward one day. Going to bed is a special action that will advance time. Time is limited. Think carefully about your schedule before you act. Call it a day and just go to sleep. Man. Yeah, we had a decent snowfall this last week, Husky, and it was kind of strange because even with the salt trucks, they don't always plow, you know, quick enough, so been driving mostly in a mix of either snow, slush, or salt, whatever kind of it is. Damn brat! I'll sue! Still, I couldn't just let that go. I'm not cruel. Ah. <sighs> I just laugh more so at like Alabama and Georgia where they get a quarter inch of snow and everybody freaks out. Nobody knows how to drive on it because they're just not practiced at it. 
I had to go home early. Flashback. I can hear a man and a woman arguing in the distance. I think they're just up ahead. How dare you crawl? Stop it! Let me go! No! Don't give me that shit. Oh, come on. The snow isn't right after. Looks like that drunk man is bothering that woman. Ow! Please stop! She's in danger. I can't ignore this. What a waste of time. You think you're worth causing me trouble, huh? I'll, I'll call the police! <laughs> call them if you want. The police are my bitches. They're not gonna take you seriously. No! Stop! Well, I mean, why are you even there, though, Potato? Like, I do not want to live in California, not because of fires, but I don't want to be near tectonic plates that are shifting like that, man. Someone called the cops, huh? Get in the car. Incompetent fools like you just need to shut your mouths and follow where I steer this country. What are you looking at? Get out of my face. Save a show. Get lost, kid. See? This is all because you're so damn slow. Get in the car. It's that weird app that somehow ended up on my phone. The icon looks almost like an eye. It's so creepy. Speaking of creepy, look at how f offset his eyes are. My eyelids are starting to get heavy. It's almost like his eyes are to the side of his face. Might as well prank Neo too while you're at it. Mayo Clinic's pretty well known up in Minnesota. No. Trickster, welcome to my velvet room. Hello, Pinocchio. You've grown. You look a lot older than I last saw you. So you've come too, inmate. The you in reality is currently fast asleep. You are only experiencing this as a dream. You're in the presence of our master. Stand up straight! Welcome. I am delighted to make your acquaintance. This place exists between dream and reality, mind and matter. It is a room that only those who are bound by a contract may enter. I am Igor, the master of this place. Remember it well. I summoned you to speak of important matters. It involves your life as well. Let me up. Know your place, inmate! Who do you think you're talking to? Still, this is a surprise. The state of this room reflects the state of your own heart. 
to think a cold and closed off. Such. You truly are a prisoner of fate. In the near future, there is no mistake that ruin awaits you. Are you kidding me? <laughs> Worry not. There is a means to oppose such a fate. You must be rehabilitated. Rehabilitated toward freedom. That is your only means to avoid ruin. Do you have the resolve to challenge the distortion of the world? Wait, what? You didn't decline. Hmm. Very well. That is enough. <laughs> you didn't say no, so Allow therefore that means to yes. Observe the path of your rehabilitation. Ah, pardon me for not introducing the others. To your right is Caroline. To your left, Justi. They serve as wardens here. Ha! Try and struggle as hard as you like. The duty of wardens is to protect inmates. We are also your collaborators. That is, if you remain obedient. I shall explain the roles of these two at another occasion. Now then. It seems the night is waning. It is almost time. Take your time to slowly come to understand this place. We will surely meet again, eventually. Time's up. Noxious alarm. Up and go back to sleep. How can I sleep with that noise? What are you talking about? When the lights go down in the city. Oh. I had a strange dream. Ruin rehabilitation. What does it mean? Hey. Looks like you're up. Well. Well then, let's go introduce ourselves properly to the staff about your transfer. The school you're attending is in the Oyama district. It'll cost you a bit to ride the train there, and the route transfers are a pain. I'll drive you there, but just for a day. Let's go. Jeez. Sheesh, men aren't usually allowed in my passenger seat. Hey man, what's that supposed to mean? <laughs> Do me a favor and behave yourself, alright? Man, I love Sojito though. You can't make fun of him, Fox. Come on, man. Don't get me wrong. I don't care what happens to you. He is a complete dick at the start of the game, but he's not actually that much of an asshole. Just don't cause me any trouble. He's just that hard ass that is in your life. To reiterate, just so we're clear, you will immediately be expelled if you cause any problems. Honestly, I hesitated on accepting someone like you. But there were some circumstances on our side. Thanks for the follow, Night Fox. You might have done a variety of things in hiding in your hometown, but you will behave yourself here. If you are thrown out from our school, there will be no place for you to go. Keep that in mind. This is the teacher in charge of your class. So I was watching a stream earlier that, like, was going into the game blind for the first time. And they're a pretty big streamer, and uh, it's just funny. He's like, he got to this certain point, and he's like, we need a counter on the screen for how many times I get threatened to get expelled or kicked out. <laughs> to ten. I think I got six total to ten. You know, there's a couple of them that you're kind of required to, but um, I got most of them. Kawakami. Here's your student ID. I messed up the interaction with the nurse because I thought of the like sarcasm between them. So I was, you know, just uh. Be sure to read the school rules. Any violations will send you straight to the guidance office. First playthrough. And if by chance you cause any problems, I won't be able to protect you at all. That is your promise, yes, Principal Kobayakawa. That's such a long name for like, no particular reason, Kobayakawa. Mm -hmm. Kabaya. He is responsible for all his actions. But really, though, why me? There should have been better candidates. It was a sudden transfer, and your class was the only one that had an opening. If you're done explaining things, mind if we get going? I got a store to get back to. Sakura-san, please keep a close eye on him. 
Don't let him cause any trouble outside. Well, I'll be sure to have a serious talk about the situation he's in. <sighs> Come to the faculty office when you arrive at school tomorrow. I'll show you to your classroom. Obviously. <sighs> They're treating you like some kind of nuisance. Guess that's what it means to have a criminal record. Turns out your past follows you wherever you go. By the way, if you get expelled now, I won't hesitate to kick you out. Got it? I think I'll scrape by. I could save us all a little time and just kick you out now if that's going to be your attitude. Ugh, school never changes, huh? Hey. Come on. We're going home. So, Potato, I have to make you a loner, right? Alright, sounds good. What a troublesome situation. I can't believe they pushed someone with a record on me. A male teacher would be better suited for this. Why in the world was someone like that admitted here? Who knows? It was the principal's decision. I was told that it's for the school's reputation. I would have thought that my volleyball team has contributed more than enough to cover that. That's certainly true. Be careful, okay? Then again, if anything were to happen, I'd kick out a student like that right away. Well, I keep wishing that he'd just end up not coming to school. How rude. Still, that isn't something I should be saying as a teacher. Well, I should be returning to practice. Oh, right. The tournament's coming up, isn't it? <laughs> Having such high expectations placed on you by others is quite a problem in itself. We'll have to work hard to make up for the track team, too. Yes, that's true. Why'd it have to be my class? Oh, woe is me. Traffic's not moving at all. You're taking the train starting tomorrow. So, how was it? The school, I mean. You think you can manage? Yeah, we'll see. Now listen up. Don't even think of doing anything stupid. Still, you were expelled once already. <laughs> to think you'd re-enroll in a different one. It's not like anyone will be sympathetic with you. That's what it was like at school. People might say stuff about me in the future, too. What a troublesome kid I've taken in. Yeah, you agreed to do it. Why did you take me in? I was asked to do it, and I just happened to agree to it. Uh, I've already been paid for it, too, after all. Yeah. A subway has derailed at Shibuya Station, greatly affecting the timetable all across the... Another accident. So that's why it's so crowded. There's been a lot of those lately. The inbound train will soon be arriving at platform number one. Please wait behind the door. direct footage from the accident. According to the police, the engineer's life was not in danger despite his injuries. After questioning, even he could not explain his high speed when approaching the station. No further comments were made. Police are still looking for a plausible motive. It's less of an operating accident and more of a crime of the company and the government. Site inspectors apparently reported all of this six months ago. The deterioration of the tracks and the ATC. Seems a railway company and the Ministry of Transport both turned a blind eye to the truth. There's no way they can hide. 
This will go all the way to the top. Now on to our main story. With this derailment accident, as well as other recent incidents of unknown motive, concern is spreading among the general public. Just what could be causing such a drastic change so suddenly in these people? SNN has Everything's linked. That's what you're thinking, which has correct? Place of late. Furthermore, according to SNN hmm. sources, oh well. Are you free? You and I haven't gone for a drink in a while. Thank you, sir. But I have another meeting to attend. I must be going. I was I was late to go for this meeting. And that's when this extremely fast train just came crashing in. Oh man. I thought I was gonna die. A noisy subway platform filled with people when suddenly. Did you ask for me? Is it a case? Not quite. I want your opinion on something. Sure. Your judgment is quite often correct, though. Can we discuss this over sushi, perhaps? You are making a student work late, after all. Conveyor belt only. <laughs> so yeah, my whole problem, though, is I hate fish to begin with. Like most seafood, I just can't do it. Can't do it. So this doesn't even appeal to me. Damn, but think there'd be that much traffic. What a waste of time. I wasn't even able to open the cafe today. Well, whatever. Fine. Just head upstairs. There's something I need to give to you. Close your eyes. <laughs> Put your hand down. Talk about a gruesome accident. 80 people were involved. It's a diary. Make sure you write in it. You may be under probation. There's no special limitations on what you do in particular. Besides following the law, that is. However, I'm obligated to report on you, which is why I'm having you record your daily activities. Hey, what's up? I'm about to leave right now. Don't worry. I'll be there in no time. Hey, you gotta do something to pass the time. Uh huh. I'll see you soon. Well, I'm off. I'll lock the place up. So do whatever you want for the rest of the night. I like how this guy, though, his whole character, his shtick is like, yeah, there's no real limit to what you do, but don't mess up. So uh, I'm gonna just leave you, you know, unsupervised, and uh, we'll go from there. All right, seems good. All right. Oh, but don't mess up my store. If something goes missing, I'll hand you right over to the cops. You got school tomorrow. You better head off to bed, all right? Potato would, like, look at him. And he'd just, like, knock a dish off. And he'd be like, it begins. Uh-huh. I don't believe you for a second, Potato. Sure, write down what happened today in my diary. You can save your game by pressing the Options button. When you see the Save command in the lower left, you can save at any time. I have an early day tomorrow. I should rest up. I should save. Write something. Let's write something. Level 1 Potato. Let's write something. That ringing sound isn't coming from my cell phone. I hear it coming from downstairs. The other funny thing I like about this is like, there's the little hints in the upper right, and it'll just say for a while, like, obey your instructions, or it'll say things like, behave like a normal student. <laughs> it's so good. Yo, it's me. Is this a prank call? Come on now, you forgot my voice already? It's Sakura. Uh, I closed up shop, but I forgot to flip the sign that closed. It's too much of a hassle for me to go back, so you flip the sign for me. I don't feel like it. Whoa there, you should know your rank by now. <laughs> I'm sure you've got a lot on your mind, but you gotta do what I say as long as you live here. Okay then, I'm leaving you in charge of the door sign. Oh man, what a task. I feel so accomplished. And 
then you like walk. There's a small, a lot of small restaurants around here. That aside, I need to get up early. I should flip the plan ahead to bed. Man, my conscience is getting the best of me. I tell you. See, the problem I have with that though is he said he never even got to open up the store. Potato. This is Potato Coon. I didn't see his potato. Many were wounded in the subway derailment accident. The train schedule is disrupted, and there's no estimate as to when the train service will resume. It seems that transit problems caused by the accident will continue into tomorrow morning. It's news coverage about the derailment. It looks like it was a major accident. Go to sleep. Upper right corner. Go to sleep. Go to sleep, potato. Is there anything else I need to do? <laughs> Go to sleep. Don't sleep. It sounds like real life. I'm just sitting here and I'm like, well, should I go to sleep or don't go to sleep? And this one almost always wins out. So I'm going to do that. So uh, I'm going to go outside, right? Can I go outside? Please. Please. Oh. Fine. Just five more minutes, though. Seriously. Need to take the train to school. Yonginjaya. Ayama. I'm going to mess this up. Transfer. It looks like I need to go out to Shibuya, then transfer there. More news about that subway accident. It sounds like a lot of people were hurt. I bet this will affect the timetables for tomorrow, too. I will need to go to bed kind of soon, husband. The strange app I saw last night is back. It keeps showing up. Potato will be, you know, deleting it again and again. I should probably reboot my phone just in case. But, that's enough. My eyelids are starting to get heavy. So, uh, Tato, is there any real reason why on your calendar you keep stabbing a knife into which day it is? It's kind of kind of dark, man. I have school starting today. Hopefully, I can get there without getting lost. I don't want to be late on my first day. I should head out now. Oh, so you actually are going to school. Here, I'll feed you. Just make sure you finish it before the customers start coming. This is my breakfast. <laughs> Don't complain, just eat. I can taste complex flavors within the bold spiciness. It's time for you to go. I'm wide awake now. Good. Hurry over to school. You'll end up late if you get lost on the way. Oh, flip the sign outside to open for me. Why should I? You don't get it, do you? That's part of your duties while you're living here. Now you better hurry on out. You're gonna be late if you get lost, country boy. As he shuts the door behind him, you just hear... Sojiro and under his breath say, Packing order. <laughs> Bar and dining. I love Sojiro. I'm just being sassy because it's potato. Literally the only reason. Also, it's kind of fun to see the other text options and responses that you don't see in the first playthrough. So many people crammed at this tiny car. Turns out the rumors about the Tokyo subway are true. 
is showing the news up on the LCD screen. It seems like there are still some lingering effects of yesterday's accident. Shibuya, this is Shibuya. Live in, yeah, like, look at the um, current objective. Live an honest student life. But it looks like I'm on the wrong side. I forget which way. I guess it's over here. There it is. Now I see the sign for it. Come on, man. I just want to go on the central stream. They make you take a specific path to get here, but it's like never the one I wind up taking later on in the game. It's so weird. say it was going to rain today huh, it's raining outside it just started all of a sudden this is why I hate the early spring it reminds me did he take an umbrella hmm who are you talking about <laughs> don't mind me so what'll it be one house blend please the effects of yesterday's subway accident continues on today, as various lines suffer delays and... There's been a lot of nasty accidents lately. You know, I mean the subway accident that the news is talking about. My co-worker got caught up in it and is in the hospital. But that aside, it's kind of creepy. The people who caused these accidents supposedly went crazy all of a sudden. I heard that some of them suffered from nervous breakdowns during interrogation. Huh. Ayama Jome. Took some time, but I finally made it. I was just listening to the uh, announcer so I could hear how he said it. Because I was curious.
<laughs> Good morning. You want me to give you a ride to school? You're gonna be late. Um, sure. Thank you. He's got such a wide jaw and nose in this Do you need a lift animation. Uh-huh. Nah. Uh. So awkward. Come on, Potato, you're better than that. Damn it! Screw that perfect teacher. Perfect teacher? What do you want? You planning on ratting me out to Kamashita? Hey, look, it's Royal. Oh my god, Husky. Don't even get me started. I like, I bought the soundtrack and I listen to that in my car, like, pretty often. So if I'm not in the mood for the radio, I just put on the uh, CDs. What do you mean? Huh? In that car just now, it was Kamoshida. He does whatever the hell he wants. Who does he think he is, the king of a castle? Don't you agree? Which castle? Uh, it's just a saying. Hmm? Wait, you don't know Kamoshida? Are you for real? You're from Shujin, right? I think so. You messing with me? <laughs> You're wearing a Shujin uniform. Huh. A second year, huh? We're the same grade, then. Never seen you before, though. Oh. You a transfer student? <laughs> then no wonder you don't know him. This rain ain't too bad. We better hurry up or we'll be late. I like the cherry blossoms are in the back. Yeah, that's about how much I got this full CDs for, and it's like, it's nice to have that physical media... And it comes with like the packet with the, actually like the lyrics and things, which is kind of cool in it. Uh, Feel lightheaded for some reason. Ah, uh, my uh. head hurts. Damn it! I want to go home. Back to the future. There was a terrible subway accident that day. You remember it, don't you? I assume you know of the uproar that the public calls the psychotic breakdown incidents. Never heard of them. That can't possibly be true. It was all over the news, and one of the victims included a teacher at your high school. I'm sorry, who? I've no doubt you heard about it. On that day, were you still an ordinary student? What do you mean? Let me change the question. You transferred to Shujin Academy, correct? An ordinary prep school that could be found in any city. That's what it should have been. What happened around that time? Tell me everything. Truthfully. Why are you taking me to these alleyways, dude?
Where's the school? This is our school. It should be. It said Shujin on the gate. What's going on here? Out of service. Where do we end up? The sign was for the school, right? I wasn't paying attention. Jeez, you freaked me out. Who are you? You a student? Obviously. Man, your costume's impressive. Is that armor real? Come on, don't just stand there, say something. Hey, what's going on? Is he school staff? <laughs> Dude, I don't know. This shit's real. C calm down. It's time out, man. We gotta run. Got it. Stop standing around and run. Yeah. What's with these guys? gonna break my bones, damn it! The hell you think you're gah! Take them away! I suppose. Hey, hey, hey! Hey! Wake up! You all right? Where are we? How should I know? I just woke up too. Looks like this ain't no dream. Yeah. What's going on? Hey, let us out of here. I know there's someone out there. Damn it. <laughs> Where are we? Is this some kind of TV set? What the hell was that just now? Too bad the day's not 4-1 and we can say how it's like the best April Fool's Day joke ever. Whoa, 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 whoa. You're shitting me, right? Man. Isn't there some way out of here? Come on, we gotta do something. Hey, should we head in here and trick the guards? Probably wouldn't work like it does in the movies, though. Uh... Hey, those chains are used for, like, torturing and stuff, right? Damn it, this shit ain't funny. Oh, dirty bed. Mm. How much time has passed since we got knocked out? Damn it, this do don't make any freaking sense. Be glad that your punishment has been decided upon. Your charge is unlawful entry. Thus, you will be sentenced to death. Say what? No one's allowed to do as they please in my castle. Huh? Wait. Is that you, Kamoshida? What's up, weirdo? Who? I thought it was some petty thief, but to think it'd be you, Sakamoto. Are you trying to disobey me again? It looks like you haven't learned your lesson at all, huh? Sakamoto. And you brought a friend this time, because you can't do anything for yourself. This ain't funny, you asshole! Is that how you speak to a king? It seems you don't understand the position you're in at all. Not only did you sneak into my castle, you committed the crime of insulting me, the king! The punishment for that is death. It's time for an execution! Take him out! Stop it! God damn it! I ain't down for this shit! Come on, we're out of here! Just go! Get out of here! 
These guys are serious. Uh oh, running away, are we? What a heartless friend you are. <laughs> he ain't a friend. Come on, hurry up and go. <laughs> Waiting for it to say the protagonist will remember that. He ain't a friend, and then the exclamation point appears. What's the matter? Too scared to run away? <laughs> Pathetic scum isn't worth my time. I'll focus on this one's execution. Take this! Take Lily scum! Useless pest! A wound. Where'd your energy from earlier go? A peasant like you isn't worth beating. I'll have you killed right now. You lost your mind? Hmm. What? Don't you dare tell me you don't know who I am. That look in your eyes irritates me. Building King. Hold him there. After the peasant, it's his turn to die. No. no, I don't want to die. <laughs> this is truly an unjust game. Your chances of winning are almost none. But if my voice is reaching you, there may yet be a possibility open to you. What's the matter? Are you simply going to watch? Are you forsaking him to save yourself? Death awaits him if you do nothing. Was your previous decision a mistake then? It wasn't. It might have been. That, that, that. Very well. I have heeded your resolve. Turn up to eleven. Ah, to me. I thou, thou art I. Thou who art willing to perform all sacrilegious acts for thine own justice. Call upon my name and release thy rage. Show the strength of thy will to ascertain all on thy own. Wilt thou be chained to hell itself? Execute him. Become a Sith Lord. I will stop you. What was that? You desire to be killed that much? Fine. You know how much those glasses cost me, man? Ken times oh. <clears throat> wrong enemy, my bad. First idea. Let's rip this off. Yikes. Going even further beyond flipping my audio with some of these sound effects. I'll have to figure out what that's about. Desire. 
I shall consider granting you the power to break through this crisis. I need your power. Hmm. Very well. Who the hell are you? Guard! Start by killing that one! You'll learn the true strength of my men! Oh no, it's a level 2 potato. We've ruined it. What? What was that just now? Got him. Ha, you like that, you son of a bitch? Y you mean this? Okay, it's locked. Damn you! Hey, what was that just now? And your clothes? Whoa, it went back to normal. <laughs> you bastards! This is effing nuts. Anyways, let's scram. You lead the way. Goddamn thieves. After them! Don't let them escape! Don't let them escape. Damn you! You bastards. You think you can get away with doing this to me? What was that? I don't give a shit. I ain't down for any of this. Come on, let's get out of here. All right. For real? Hmm? They're looking for us, right? I ain't playing along with this anymore. We gotta find a way out of this goddamn place. <laughs> this is th the exit? Hey, let's get the hell out of this place. Dude, you gotta be joking. This ain't the exit? What the hell is this place? What the hell? Huh? Hey, look. We really did hear people screaming. So we ain't the only ones who got captured. Is, uh, is he okay? Huh? There's something up there, a bridge. And is that a statue? What the Another hell? dead end. Damn it, how the hell are we supposed to get out of here? 
Hey, you there. Hey. Blondie, frizzy hair. Look over here. Uh, what, what is this, is this thing? thing? You're not soldiers of this castle, right? Get me out of here. Look, the key's right there. We're trying to get the hell out of here. I mean, you obviously look like an enemy, too. I'm locked up here, so how can I be your enemy? Help me out! A cat? <laughs> I am not a cat! Say that again and I'll make you regret it! They're catching up already! Shit, there's still no service. Ain't there any way to contact someone outside? How the hell do we get out? Hey, you two! Want to know where the exit is? Let me out, and I'll take you there. You don't want to get caught and executed, right? You better not be lying. I'm not lying. It's the truth. Then why are you sweating? I see that that sweat by your eyeball. Inside of your head. This thing sounds like it's all talk. If you guys think you can get out on your own, then be my guest. What do we do? Are you seriously not messing with us? You don't hurry, they'll catch you. Fine. Uh, ah, freedom tastes so great. Now where's the exit, you monster cat? Don't call me a cat. I am Morgana. Shut up and hurry it up. You want to be locked up again? Oh, all right, sheesh. Follow me and stay quiet. Jeez. It's fourth period already. Sakura san, uh, Sakura san said that uh, Kun Kun <laughs> left the house this morning. Should I contact them? No, that'll just be more of a hassle. Uh, what did I do to deserve this? Well, I guess we just gotta follow it. Hey. What, are you, what are you doing? What does it look like I'm doing? I'm lowering the bridge. Well. You, frizzy hair. It seems like you pick up on things faster than our blondie over there. Try checking out the mouth of the statue, okay? How are we supposed to know to do that? Amateur, come on, let's get going. <laughs> oh shit! Oh shit, it's them! You amateur! Stay still! Hey you! You can fight, right? Let's go! Come! Zora. You got one of those things too? <laughs> we will promptly shut them up. Damn shadows. They've taken up intercept positions. It means they're holding nothing back and are serious to kill us. I'll back you up. So fight like your life depends on it. <laughs> I knew you were an amateur. This is how you fight! Zoro! Strike at an enemy's weakness to knock them down. Use that opening to strike again! That's the most basic of basics. Remember it well! Skills have varying elements, and each enemy is weak to certain elements. If you attack an enemy's weakness, you will deal more damage and knock them down. You'll be able to take another reaction after knocking an enemy down. This is called a one more. You then topple another enemy, you'll gain another one more. This will continue as long as you continue to attack enemy weaknesses. Come on, let's hurry and get through this! Wait, it's my resolve! Oh, I'm mad now! <laughs> Bada bum bum. 
Boom, boom, boom. Power courses through me. Power courses through me. Okay. Another tool for our mission. Oh. Not bad. Your persona is per uh, pretty powerful. Persona. You mean that thing that comes out of you guys all dramatic like? Yes, you saw how Frizzy here, here ripped off his mask when he summoned it, right? Well, everybody wears a mask deep within their heart. By removing that... Whoa. Huh? You turn back to normal. Hmm, it looks like you don't have full control over your power yet. The transformation shouldn't normally dissolve like that, after all. Uh... Yeah, that's enough. This crap doesn't make any sense. Can't you just sit still and listen for once, Blondie? Don't call me Blondie. My name's Ryuji. Actually, there's no time for me to lecture you. You want to escape this place in one piece, right? Let's go. Oh, but before that, take these. Use them carefully, okay? Okay. Come on, we should hurry. It's not much further to the exit. Now then. Just make sure you're good on HP, okay? There's still a chance we'll have to end up fighting. Here. You can auto-recover by pressing the square button. Our recovery uses your party's healing skills on all party members. Be aware that the required SP will still be used. Lovely. Glad you stick to your guns. Mm. Looks like it's raring to go too. Let's get away before more show up. Hold on, we can't just leave these guys here. You really don't get it, do you? There's no time to explain. Look, I'm going. If you don't want to follow, be my guest. <laughs> Damn it, fine, I'm coming. Well, pixies aren't too bad, because once you get the gun, it's not really that difficult most of the time. We're here. Oh, finally, we're saved. It's not opening. Did you trick us, you jerk? Don't jump to conclusions. Over here. Hey, wait up. Where are we supposed to get out from here? There aren't even any windows. Ugh, amateur. This is the most basic of basics. That's right! As I thought, you're a natural at this. It leads all the way outside. You're welcome, Matina. I see. Then we just gotta get that metallic mesh off. And a one, and a... Oh, crap. The enemy didn't hear us, did they? Seriously, we're finally getting out of here! You shouldn't wait on celebrating until you actually get out. I'm playing on normal Husky just because since I've already played through it, I'm mainly trying to just do it to see the other like cutscenes and um, the secret boss and stuff like that. Now get going. But what about you? There's something that I still have to do. We're going our separate ways. 
Don't get caught again. <laughs> you better be careful too. See ya. Those two seem useful, especially the frizzy haired one, if my judgment's right. Get me out of here. Did we make it? You have returned to the real world. Welcome back. Huh? Returned? Does that mean we got away? Probably. <laughs> I don't know what to think anymore. What was all that anyways? That castle and, and Kamoshida and that weird cat? What the hell's going on? What's with the yelling? Are you students of Shujin? Cutting classes, are we? Huh? Uh, no. We were trying to get to school, and we ended up at this weird castle. <sighs> what? Oh, hand over your bag. You better not be doing any drugs. Why would you think that? Are you his friend? You seem quite friendly with him, though. Anyway, you should go to school. Like I'm trying to say, I don't know what's going on either. We passed by Shujin on our way here. There was nothing out of the ordinary about it. If you spout any more nonsense, I'll contact your school. Is that what you want? Come on, say something. Uh, that's not what I meant. Wait a sec. Is that guy for real? Fine, I'm going. Got him. A minister of transport announcing his resignation. <laughs> Things are going as planned. Sai Nijima. That reminds me. Leave it be for now. Is this for real? I'm sure we came the same way. What's going on here? That's exactly what I wanted to ask you. We received a call from the police. The damn cop snitched on us after all. Story. <clears throat> hmm, it's rare not to see you alone. Where were you roaming around until this time? I have a Morgana plushie here from that take your heart edition, and it's it's sitting here as I'm playing the game. Uh, a, ca a castle? Uh, a, a, ca a, 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 a castle? So you have no intention just like of giving oil. an honest answer. What's this about a castle? Kamoshida? You seem so carefree, Sakamoto. Quite a difference from when you did morning practice for the track team. Shut up! It's your fault that it... How dare you speak that way to Mr. Kamoshida? <sighs> There's not much leeway left for you, you know? He's the one that provoked me! Do you really want to be expelled? In any case, you'll have to explain yourself. Follow me. What? This is bullshit! Come now, I should have been more considerate too. Let's just say that we were both to blame. Well, if you say so. Still, you're coming with me. It's undeniable that you're extremely late. Extremely late. Fine. By the way, you're that new transfer student, correct? Potato coon. The glare. The death stare. Have we met somewhere? I saw a girl in your car. That's right. 
I remember now. <laughs> his his face there's peeing. Well, I'll overlook this just for today. I'm sure you've heard from the principal. But cause any trouble and you'll be expelled. Understand? <laughs> Can you overlook more? Is that supposed to be a joke? I'm not laughing. At any rate, hurry up and go to the faculty office. I'm sure Ms. Kawakami's tired of waiting. Good luck trying to enjoy your new school life. Back to the future. The school turned into an old castle? A talking cat? Are you hallucinating from an overdose? I won't put up with you if you're simply joking around. I'm going to have you continue the story. The one who received a calling card from the Phantom Thieves was an Olympic medalist. An alumnus from Shujin Academy. The PE teacher, Suguru Kamoshida. It's true that what he did were deplorable crimes from... indulging his desire. He confessed to it all. But there should have been no connection between the two of you since you had just transferred. Why did you target him? I'll tell you later. That's unacceptable. Try and recall it once again. It is nice that they include like the summary aspect, so like say so you put it down for a while. Scary. Ugh, unbelievable. Being over half a day late on your first day, can you explain yourself? Nope. I was in a cast. You can't be serious. Will you pull yourself together? You were given fair warning yesterday. More importantly, I heard that you were caught along with that Sakamoto coon. That Sakamoto? Or Sakamoto? <sighs> Don't get involved with him, okay? He's nothing but trouble. He wasn't like that when he was devoting his time to track and field, though. Anyway, break's almost over. Classes will end after fifth period today because of the subway accident. I'll have you introduce yourself when class resumes. Follow me. She seems to be able to have a lot of time to sit around and do stuff. By the way, when you introduce yourself, be serious about it even if you're lying to the class, okay? Do not say anything unnecessary. You think that's him? Huh? The one in the rumors? Being super late on his first day? He really is insane. He looks normal, though. But he might slug us if we look him in the eye. <sighs> Settle down. Well, I'd like to introduce a transfer student. Today, we had him attend from the afternoon on, since he wasn't feeling well. All right, please say something to the class. I'm Potato Killer. He seems quiet, but I bet when he loses it... I mean, he was arrested for assault. Uh, so... Your seat will be... Hmm. Over there, the one that's open. Sorry, but can the people nearby please share your textbooks with him for today? Ugh, this sucks. <sighs> Lies. Huh? <sighs> Did you catch that? Do those two know each other? Ooh, does that mean he hit on her before transferring here? Obviously, that's what it would have to be, like, seriously. 
That means she's cheating on him with Mr. Kamoshida. Like, that's so bad if students are talking about, like, a student dating a teacher or something. It's then so again, weird. This is Takamaki-san we're talking about. For so real. That side of the room is totally awful. Oh, right. The volleyball rallies in two days. Everyone's just changed classes, so make sure you use that time to get to know each other. Well, then, let's get class started. Who's on duty today? Everyone, please rise. How much of Kyle's playthrough did you see, Husky? Or do you know about this game? Hmm? What's wrong? Is this a castle? Are you sure you're okay? Also, it seems like people are already talking about you, but I'm not the one who told them. I can't even catch a break. Why do I have to deal with this? You should head straight home without stopping by anywhere. Sakura-san sounded pretty angry. Oh, and about Sakamoto-kun, don't get involved. Speak of the devil. Rude. What do you want? I heard the police caught you cutting classes today. <sighs> it was nothing. And you haven't dyed your hair back to black, either. Sorry about that. I'll be waiting on the rooftop. <sighs> See? That's why I don't want you getting involved. Understood? Why did you allow a student like him to transfer here? He's already started associating with Sakamoto. A student with a criminal record and the culprit of an assault case. I don't know, Potato Coon. I wouldn't put it past you. How much you. I contribute to the school? Now, don't be like that. This school counts on you, Kamoshida Kun. You are our star. Still, a steady buildup is necessary behind such brilliance as well. Your troubles never seem to end, do they, Principal Kobayakawa? All right, I understand. I'll continue to do my best to answer your expectations of me. Sakamoto seems eager to talk about something. We should meet him on the roof. Up on the roof. Up on the roof. That was an off limit sign posted, but it looks like the door is unlocked. Oh, Ock. Ock. There you are. Sorry for calling you up here like this. I bet Kawakami already told you stuff like, don't get involved with him, huh? Nope. <laughs> I thought you'd say that. I heard you got a criminal record. Everyone's talking about it. No wonder you were so gutsy. What was all that that happened? You know, how we almost got killed at a castle. It wasn't a dream, right? You remember it too, yeah? Yeah. Well, just because we both remember it doesn't mean much, though. I mean, even if it was a dream, you saved me from Kamoshida. So yeah, uh, thanks. Thanks, Potato. You're welcome. It's okay, oh, you're welcome. That Kamoshida we saw there. Probably don't know about it, but there are some rumors about him. You know, the guy you met at the school gates, the ripped one. That asshole who was all full of himself at the castle. No one says anything against him because he's some medalist who took the volleyball team to nationals. The way Kamashita was king of that castle felt crazy real because of that. I wonder if we can go back to that castle again. Ah, forget it. It must have all been a dream. It has to be. Sorry to drag you out here like this. That's all I had to say. You know, we might be pretty similar. I feel like we're gonna get along just fine as troublemakers. I'm Ryuji Sakamoto. I'll come talk if I see you around. Don't ignore me, alright? Don't ignore me, alright? 
Bye, Royal. Even has five letters and starts with an R. Obediently return home. You got an interesting call from your school today. It's only your first day and you're already showing up hours late. It was an accident. Yeah, that's what everyone says. Look, just behave yourself. Your life's forfeit if anything happens. You understand the meaning of probation, right? I do. Okay. Hey, what's up? Yeah, I just closed up shop. I'll be there in half an hour. What is it? Hey, what are you standing around for? Go hurry on up. No, I just hired a part timer. Yo. Don't forget to lock the door and turn off all the lights, okay? Yep, I'm leaving now. I told you, he's a part timer. Man, I still think them cats are crazy. I'll just add this. Alright. And with that. It's getting really late, and I have to wake up early, so I am going to be calling stream right here. Appreciate you coming out tonight. Thanks for uh, a couple of people with the follows, and if you're watching and lurking, appreciate it. Hope you consider following if you do, and um, hope you enjoyed a little bit. I'm not sure when I'll stream again, maybe tomorrow, um, and then if not, more likely on, on Thursday, just depending on how I'm feeling and things are going, so... Um, appreciate it and uh, I'll just switch over to a little ending stream screen here and uh, it's got uh, like Twitter and YouTube and discord so not a big deal but uh, I'll let you know about that stuff too so thanks again and I hope you all have a good night